Hello everyone. Hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Shantae here. So I wanted to come in and share with you guys my submission for Anna's um, ATC challenge. And so um, I was in the, she said we could do what we, whatever we chose to do. And I was in the mood for um, some mixed media, which I haven't did in like forever, such a long time. So I just pulled out the eight, uh, my ATCs and just started playing. So um, let me show you guys what I did. And I guess if you not if you don't really like mixed media, you won't like these. But to each his own. So I was glad that she gave us uh, control to do what we wanted to do. So I did three because I was on a roll. <laughs> so I did three, and I all of these are. The base is this uh, white paint right here because I uh, couldn't find my gesso, so this still worked out fine. Okay, so I'm gonna sit this punch right here so y'all can it can have some proper begins. So the first one um, is that one, and okay, so the background I used a lot of new stuff that I haven't used, I bought but had ever used on these, so. Um, that's the reason why I'm proud of the way that they turned out. Okay, so this one, like I said, I used a white back, white background. Okay, white paint. That's the background. And then I sprayed, um, just in different spots, these fireworks sprays. Um, right here. This color, this color, and uh, I'm using my iPad, so I got to get used to not having the screen is so close up on the screen. Let's see. I don't want y'all to see all my mess though. <laughs> okay, so I used um these fireworks sprays right here. Um Pal Tart, um Paris Dusk and Tangelo. Uh just different spots and the name describes how they spray out just all over the place. So I used those, okay, on the first one. And then I stamped this stamp uh, set right here. I used two stamp sets by Inspired Heart and the background. This is one that's called Background Stamp right here. I used this one. And then I used the one called Flower Value Pack, and I used that flower right there. Um, to stamp the corners, and then I also use the sentiment that says, um, right here, the grass withers. It says, The grass withers, the flowers fade, but the word of our God stands forever. Isaiah 40 and 8, because I know she is a Christian. All right, so the uh, I stamped the background with this right here, and then uh, the sentiment I stamped with, um. Uh, Art, this uh, memories art pink brown art print brown so that's the first one like I said very simple and the fireworks also have a hint of uh, it has a little shimmer to it too oh and then I sealed everything too with um, my Connie Heaven seal if you can see I don't know if you can see the shine underneath the stuff on the sprays they have a little shine to it it's um Really funky. It's it got a lot of little funky background effect. I really like it. I don't like I said, use my iPad. I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell. So that was the first one. The second one, uh, let's see. Um is the I you show this. This is another one that I did, and it just says um journal, journal art ideas or journal art ideas or whatever. So for the background, I just went like a little kid up. Uh, Swiss paint out and just took my hand and just rubbed it on the background. I'm saying all this because she wanted us to say, um, you know, so I like explain what we did. So I used um, around the edges, I used this uh, liquid tech basic paint uh, just around the edge. And then I went in with this red and yellow. Like I said, I just smushed around like a little kid. And I left some of the spaces white just because, you know. I don't, you don't want it perfect. I used this Phenobar stencil on top of that. Um, this Phenobar stencil on top of that. But I used this. See, I got it. I hate that these don't snap. I used this uh, Colorbox Mixed Media Ink. 
but it is not permanent so once i did you can see the definition from the stencil before uh, you can still see it in certain spots but once i put the um the sealing on it it wiped it off which i didn't realize but you know again i'm still cool with it so um i stamped on a manila tag those words um using this stamp set from inspire heart called journal um called journal shapes like for your art journal shapes i use that stamp set to get the words off and then um I went around the edges with uh, my charcoal pencil. All right, so that's it. Let me move right along. I'm taking too long because I am using my iPad. And I want this thing to shut out, shut down. Okay, so the last one is very simple uh, as well. Here it is. Okay, so for the base, again, the white paint, like I did with all of them. But then I colored it. I colored the whole thing in this blue uh paint and then i went over with this dream Re weaver crackle and boston paste oh this is phenomenal love the way this love that and you can see um it has very fine cracks and so you can see some of the blue from the bottom but once i did that um it just looked too plain to me so what i did i <clears throat> took back out my uh, fireworks and I use uh, dandelion um, cottage ivy and I went back with this Paris dust and just sprayed in different spots and then again it's still all of it still of course plain and then I went and pulled out uh, this Simon said oops Simon said stamp set called art art for borders okay and i used that one because i wanted just to do something uh, and of course because the background was cracked it was not going to be perfect which was fine fine with me so i stamped that in uh this new range ink color carnation red and let's see what else did i do okay yeah and then i just used this tim ho stamp set the world the world of reality has its limits but the world of imagination is boundless. I used that one and just went around the edges and stamped that in this one. The stencil. So that's it. So um, like I said, these are very simple. But um, I still like the way they turned out. So this is the last one that I did. I just got to finish the back. So this one and then this is my first one. All right, you guys. So I'm going to cut this out so this can upload and um yeah i'll be back with another video you guys have a great day bye bye